நீயில்லாத நாளல்ல நாளாகுமா நீயில்லாத வாழ்வல்ல வாழ்வாகுமா First Chronicles chapter 4 verse 10 Jabez cried out to the God of Israel How oh, that you would bless me and enlarge my territory let your hand be with me and keep me from harm so that I will be free from pain and God granted his request reason for Jabez's pain was the result of his mother that she named him pain when she gave birth to him his name Jabez has turned as a curse to him in general It is said that women will be happy after having children but in his life since he was named as Jabez as long as she lived she looked at him as sorrow his name should have been changed at least at the time of circumcision during those preliminary rites which ought to be performed for him according to the law but it has not changed all the days she was alive she looked at him as sorrow what a terrific thing it was She should have been a blessed mother thinking of his mother should have been the happiest woman the son should have done all the works for his mom wholeheartedly and with gratitude but Jabez was saddened that it would not happen in his case already he had lost his father and his life has become full of sorrows and that is why Jabez prayed Keep me from harm so that I will be free from pain. Oh Lord, the curse should not continue. Because of the curse, I should not lose what I have. You are my only way and you alone are my help. He prayed this prayer to cast away this curse and this sorrow to be departed. And also he prayed, keep me from harm. What does it mean? It doesn't mean that there should be no harm. and should live a happy life instead jabez prayed that whole oh law even though the harm comes it should not grieve me and it should not spoil the relationship between us god sometimes plays some defects in our body in order to continue in our relationship with him do not take it as a curse no matter how many prayers may go unanswered do not think that the lord does not hear your prayers It is the grace of the Lord that you should continue to be in relationship with him. The children of God listen to this. When you come unto Jesus, when you pray, the curse will leave you. Your faithful prayer will take away the curse from you and the curse will be turned into a blessing. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! God bless you.